Former First Lady Patience Jonathan was in the presidential villa to visit the First Lady and wife of the President, Senator Olurebi Tinubu, at the State House Abuja. The former First Lady thanked Senator Tinubu for how she's impacted the lives of Nigerian women so far. She said it's imperative for her as a wife to a former president to also support and encourage Senator Oluremi Tinubu on things that would move the nation forward. Patience Jonathan commended women groups for their support for President Bola Tinubu and his wife, pleading that they should maintain their support for the government in order to sustain the patriotic efforts so far taken by the federal government. The majority of our you know, youth, especially our children, we should start giving them a proper reorientation about how they are supposed to work. It's very tough to now, how they are supposed to work in a, you know, a good community, you know, of help. You know, they, they are quite too lavish in the way they do things nowadays. And I think it has to do with the influence of social media. Mm -hmm. So, and, uh, but we have to give them an alternative. We have to give them a hope and make them realize who they are as Nigerians. I use this opportunity also to plead to the women of this country because I know that my sister can carry the women along. She carried the women along when she was a governor's wife. So when she's a first lady, the sky will be her limits. She will carry us along and she will move us forward. We Nigerian women, we should come out in mass and support this government and support her. This Meanwhile, the First Lady Senator Lurebi Tinubu has called on all women, especially mothers, to see to the reorientation of the youth in the nation and get them back on the path of good values and morals. She said this when the National Executive of the National Council for Women's Societies visited her at the State House in Abuja. The First Lady also pointed out that as mothers, the council and indeed all women must be deliberate about helping the youth and encouraging them to shun social vices.